Good, how are you doing?
pick our showmanship winners today. Okay, very good. You all did very, very well today. Thank you for coming. Uh, okay, how I broke again. You all look very, 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 very nice. Uh, can you hear me now? Not really. You really have to hold it to your mouth. <laughs> okay, uh, you posed the birds well. Okay, we need to, you know, practice examining the birds a little bit better. A lot of people cut it short, you know, um, you know, with the breast, you're supposed to go down and check the vet and the legs. And we have to remember to do that. Uh, remember, there's 10 primaries. There's supposed to be 10 primaries, 10 secondary feathers, and uh, one axillary feather. A lot of these birds lack, but in the ideal situation, it's supposed to be 10, 10, and 1. Uh, and we have to remember, you know, to check the breast for a perfect keel bone when we examine the bird. Again, all these birds are very well trained. They pose extremely well today. Very, very impressed probably the best, you know, posing of birds I've seen. I've been doing this for many, many years. Again, the quality condition of the birds is quite nice today. Some are a little bit better than others, but uh, most, of them, most of the birds are in pristine condition. Okay, uh, in and out of the cage, we kind of didn't do today, but you always put a bird in head first and take it out head first. Very important to remember that. Again, walking the bird. Uh, most of these birds were very, very well trained today. Again, I'm very, very impressed. Uh, only in one situation here did somebody actually have to touch the bird. Um, again, if we touch the bird, or if it's a regular chicken-type showmanship, and the bird flies off the table, or you touch it, you lose 15 points. So all these birds were quite well trained. I can see that you guys have been practicing quite well. Uh, again, uh, poise and enthusiasm is really there. Okay, we need to work on knowledge. Okay, it's very, very important in poultry and, uh, again, like rabbit showmanship. Um, okay, know your breed, know your variety. Okay, uh, today these are market turkeys, and they're called broad-breasted white. Okay, there are seven recognized varieties of turkeys. Okay, we have the Royal Blanc, Royal Palm, Blue Sage, Black Spanish, uh, White Holland, uh, and I forget the, a few others that are recognized by the American Poultry Association. Okay, there's only one breed of turkey, okay, and um, all the other different are just varieties, different colors, okay? Um, okay, a baby turkey is called a poult, P-O-U-L-T. It takes uh, 28 days to incubate a turkey egg, and uh, turkey eggs are usually like a speckled brown color, but we need to remember that. Uh, the main uh, cuts the meat off of a market turkey or the breast, thigh, legs, and wing. Those are the primary cuts of meat off of the market turkey. And again, you should know what protein feed that, you know, you're feeding the bird. You know, everybody, you know, buys different brands and different proteins. And, you know, it varies from place to place. In a market turkey, mostly it's management. I've been in the situation where, let's say, a 4-H club has uh, purchased, let's say, 50 turkeys from a hatchery, and they distribute it amongst the different uh, participants, and each, you know, person has a different result. Depends upon the way you keep the birds, um, what you feed them, the amount of daylight, you know, so on and so forth. So you all did very, very well today, and thank you for coming, and uh, so the main thing that we need to work on, we're going to examine the bird, and, uh, you know, knowledge. Uh, what you need to do is get a copy of the uh, 4-H FFA uh, poultry standard for showmanship. which is step-by-step -step instructions. And get a copy of the American Poultry Association Standard Perfection. And it tells you all the different varieties of turkey. So what to look for in each variety. Okay? Okay, very good. So today, eighth place goes to uh, Marley. Uh, seventh place goes to Anthony. Uh, sixth place goes to Francis. Uh, fifth goes to Emily. Uh, fourth goes to Aubrey. Uh, third goes to Lincoln. Uh, second place goes to Creighton. 
And uh, first place goes to Jennifer. Congratulations, everybody. Now remember, thank your parents and thank your FFA and 4-H advisors for bringing you here today.